Welcome, 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 um, Sagittarians. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. All right, Sagittarian, let's see what is happening in transforming. So you're dealing with people in power and managers and Sagittarian business people. Um, you're standing your ground. Um, and I see that they're going to be recognizing what a Aries Lee or a Sagittarian man has done or a businessman. Um, or your managers, and I see success is going to be here for you, Sagittarian. The secrets of an Aries Leo or Sagittarian um, businessman is coming out, and I see that you, Sagittarian, are going to get in some sort of a help to balance out a situation. I see justice came down on this person, and justice is being revealed. Now, the energy of the emperor is always about manager. Okay, it's a masculine energy, so it's always about a manager. Okay, it's always about a leader. So, um, the words of power, authority, order, control, and it's Mars, the um, Mars, the planet of war. So, I see that they're going to be recognizing that, um, your manager had a whole lot of secrets. So, so if you see the energy of the eye princess, the eye princess is about. The energy of the moon, um, um, the silver lorn of the rules of the moon, the whispers, revelation, revelation, um, that is going to be coming out, some sort of a revelation, the secrecy, people could be secretly whispering um, about your manager or whispering about an Aries um, businessman and it's true. Yeah, and it's going to be now coming out that is true about this uh, um, Aries businessman. And I see you Sagittarian are going to be overcoming this. So we it's about the secrecy, the revelation, a revelation about your manager or a businessman or an Aries or Sagittarian businessman that is going to be coming out. And it's as if people were whispering about this person, about something, some sort of a secrecy that this person had is now going to be revealed, revelation. So it's a month of revelation. It's a month of you finding out about a client, an Aries Leo or a Sagittarian client, okay? And this is really the energy of Mars. So it is ruled by the Aries. It is ruled by Artarian figure. It is ruled by managers, people in power. And, they're going to, I, and I see the truth is going to be coming out. They're going to be really recognized what this person have done. Um, so we see the energy of the moon and the energy of the moon is about secrecy and the secrecy that your manager or your boss uh, or um, you as a manager that was keeping is going to be um, coming out because the energy of the moon is about um, releasing the secrecy that was old, okay? It is about um, uh, secrecy and um, illusion. So they're going to be recognizing that an Aries man, an Aries businessman was creating a lot of illusion and you Sagittarian are going to be either revealing it or is going to be finding out about it. So um, the energy of the moon has the Pisces energy of the watery of the illusion that this person was creating, okay? And the energy of the moon is about secrecy and the illusion that um, managers or a businessman or an Aries man or your client that was having, it's going to be coming out in the first week. In the second week, we have the energy of the two of swords. And what do we know from the energy of the two of swords is that the energy of the two of swords has to do with and its association with discernment and discrimination, discernment and discrimination and mistrust, okay? And this is upright. So the moon in Libran, so the moon in Libran is that um, the illusions um, of a uh, Aries businessman is going to be coming out and you Sagittarians are going to be winning. They're going to be recognizing that a Aries businessman and a young cancer, they have created a whole lot of illusion and had a whole lot of secrecy together. So um, it is uh, the and it's as if uh, um, the, 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 the discrimination 
is coming up where um the truth is now coming out the energy of the moon in libran is that a libran could be um uh, telling you sagittarian about the collaboration of an aries businessman or a collaboration of your manager together with a cancer okay so if you notice uh, um, and that is going to help you to win a situation that your Sagittarian has been dealing with because this Libra is going to be letting you know um, that an Aries businessman and a Cancer has been creating some form of illusion where they were getting money on the false pretense. So, okay, so whoever this Libra is, I think this Libra recognized that your Sagittarian was not aware of what was going on and you live and, and, um, um, you, uh, Librans, the Librans is going to be um, really alerting you, Sagittarian, um, not to trust uh, um, your boss and a cancer or not to trust an Aries businessman and a cancer or not to trust a businessman and his associates because they have been lying. So in your foundation, Mercury in Cancer. So obviously, the celebrant recognized that uh, um, you, Sagittarius, was not aware that your manager and this cancer was communicating and was creating some sort of an illusionary situation in order to acquire um, money. So when we look at the energy of the Three of Cups, it is about pleasure of the moment that they had their secrets and uh, con uh, communication Mercury in Cancer, they had their secret and was really communicating and really creating a mess and creating illusion that you were not aware of. And I see this Libra is going to be alerting you as what is going to be transpiring. At the end of the day, Sagittarians, you are the one that is going to be very, very successfully coming out of this situation because um, they are going to be really taking down um, this um, um, this boss and his associate, this boss and this cancer, they're going to be taking them down. The energy of the Six of Pentacles is here. And whenever the Six of Pentacles comes up, um, this is the energy of uh, a moon in Taurus. So um, if you recognize how much moon is here, there's a lot of secrecy. Um... And so you have the moon in Cancer, you have the moon in Taurus, you have the moon here, you have the high princess. There is so much secrecy and illusion that is going on. Oh my God. So, oh my God. So um, the moon in Taurus is that a Taurus is also connected and that a Taurus had a work um, and collaborated. So the moon in Taurus is uh, um, the Taurus at secrecy and the Taurus if the Taurus was a boss, the Taurus could be um, connecting with this Aries boss or with the boss because um, it's a leadership um, person. And you're going to be recognizing the secrecy that these people were holding. So the energy of the moon is is, is secrecy and is, is the secrecy of your boss, you know. And I see that uh, whatever is happening and transpiring Sagittarian, um, a Taurus, they're going to be coming down on a Taurus. The law is going to be coming down on the Taurus, okay? And I see that a Libran is going to be giving up a Taurus. And this law, it, you know, the law could come down on the Libran and they recognize and the Libran is going to be um, telling the secrets of uh, this uh, um, Aries businessman. Uh, or your boss, and it's going to be telling the secrets of the Taurus and the Cancer. So they're going to be recognizing um, the moon in uh, Cancer in the moon. The moon in Cancer, the Cancer has a secret. The Cancer had some sort of a secret collaboration with a Taurus. So a Taurus, a Cancer, and a Aries businessman was creating some sort of an illusion and has created some sort of a illusionary contract and was creating illusion some sort of an illusionary situation with a business and i see that a taurus there the law is going to be coming down that a taurus repay a whole lot of money either to you sagittarian or 
to your company or repay a whole lot of money because they they now recognize what is happening and transpiring. So again, secrecy is a secrecy, the illusion and secrecy um, of a Libra, a Taurus, and a Cancer, and your manager. For some of you, is your manager. For some of you, is your biz a businessman. Um, some of you, it could have been that your husband run a business and he was having these sort of an illusionary situation that was happening. And it's as if the boss is going to be finding out the, the cancer secret and the connection between this cancer and the stories and the secrecy. People are now recognizing that these people were running some sort of a fraud. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. So this is like serious, serious situation that is happening. There is no question about it. The, the, these, these situations are really, really serious. Um, and I see that the law is going to be coming in. I see that they're going to be recognizing the fraud, the fraud that has been um, running and the fraud that was created and they're going to be recognizing that a Taurus a fraud here, a Taurus together with an Aries businessman and a cancer at fraud here, a company of a whole lot of money and um, created some sort of an illusionary company and was taking money from people on the false pretend and was uh, pretending that a company was theirs, this illusion um, that they were creating. So they were defrauding the company, but also defrauding a whole lot of people. Oh my God. Justice comes in because this is as if a Libran could have been caught up or a Libran could be caught. And this Libran is going to be um, alerting you Sagittarian and letting you Sagittarian know the illusion um, that um, that was going on, the fraud that was going on, and you were not even aware of um, realizing that there was a huge fraud. And if you notice, a Taurus and a business, an Aries or a Sagittarian businessman, but this is like your boss for some of you, and for some of you, it's like your clients, a businessman, or it, it could be your manager. And they're going to be now recognizing the huge fraud um, that this person have created. And you're going to be um, really, really surprised to recognize that the person that has created these fraud. So Sagittarian, you could be the person, um, the person that is going to be bringing the situation in balance. You could be the person that they call in um, to, um, you know, recognize because it, it, it's as if, I don't know whether you're a lawyer or um, you were the solicitor, the solicitator for this uh, businessman, but they're going to be recognizing that this businessman has created some sort of a fraud, illusionary company, and was defrauding a lot of people. And the network of this uh, company or this uh, network of people is um, a cancer, an Aries businessman, and a Taurus, uh, and this is uh, cancer. Um, the moon in cancer, or cancer in moon, moon in cancer. This is the energy of the moon in cancer. And with this energy of the moon in cancer, is that this cancer had a lot of secret and was collaborating. Yeah, Mercury in cancer. Three of cups is Mercury in cancer. There was a lot of uh, communication between this cancer and this Aries, the Earth, Sagittarian businessman or um, this businessman, okay? And the truth is now going to be revealed because a Libra is going to be opening up, okay? The law, it could be the Libra or the law, because whenever the Two of Swords comes up, the Two of Swords is talking about the Libra and the law. The Two of Swords is the energy of uh, the moon in Libra, and the moon in Libra, it is about uh, um, the secrecy. A Libra is going to be speaking up and is going to be alerting a whole lot of you. Some sort of a secrecy 
um, that was kept and a Libran is going to be letting out the secrecy and letting people and advising people about uh, the collaboration with a um, group of people that was fraudering a lot of people and created some sort of a fraud contract. I got a girl. Namaste. Until next time. Please remember to like, share, thumbs up. Namaste.